William Carey was an English Christian missionary, particular Baptist minister, a translator, social reformer, cultural anthropologist who founded colleges and universities in India. He was born on 17th August in 1761 in England country. William Carey, the oldest of five children, who was born to Elizabeth Carey. William was raised in Church of England. As a child, he was keenly interested in natural sciences. As a young man, Carey went to work for the local shoemaker. Then he married and had seven children, five sons and two daughters, during which time he taught himself Hebrew, Italian, Dutch, French, often reading while working on the shoes. Later, Carey founded Baptist Missionary Society in 1789. Carey became the full-time pastor and started preaching gospel to everyone with burden. Later, Carey with his family sailed from London abroad, a British ship for the missionary life in India, and landed in Calcutta in November 1793. During first year, they supported themselves and a place to establish their mission. They also began to learn the Bengali language to communicate with others. During the six years that Carey managed the Indigo plant, he completed the first revision of his Bengali New Testament, including communal living. At that time, his son Peter died of dysentery. Along with other causes of stress resulted his wife Dorothy suffering a nervous breakdown from which she never recovered. Then Carey set up a print shop and began the task of printing the Bible in Bengali. In year 1800, the mission had their first convert, a Hindu named Krishnapal. Carey also used his influence with the Governor General to help put a stop to the practices of infant sacrifice at Sate. His wife died in 1807 due to mental breakdown. From the printing press at the mission came translations of the Bible in Bengali, Sanskrit and other major languages. Many of these languages had never been printed before. On 11th March 1812, a fire in the print shop caused 10,000 pounds in damage and lost work. However, the press itself and the punches were saved and the mission was able to continue printing in six months. In Carey's lifetime, the mission printed and distributed the Bible in whole in 44 languages. In 1818, the mission founded Serampur College to train ministers for the growing church and to provide education in the arts and sciences to anyone regardless of caste or country. And later it became degree-granting institution, the first in Asia. And Kiri was entrusted to maintain the botanical garden in Calcutta. The genus Karaya was named after him. William Kiri spent 41 years in India without a furlough. His mission counted some 700 converts in a nation of millions, but he laid an impressive foundation of Bible translations, education and social reform. He has been referred to as the father of modern missions and as India's first cultural anthropologist. His teaching, translations, writings and publications, his educational establishments and influence in social reform are said to have marked the turning point of Indian culture from a downward to an upward trend. Kheri saw India not as a foreign country to be exploited, but as his heavenly father's land to be loved and saved.